glad you've joined us for another safari. Safari! Safari! <laughs> We're at the end of another jungle survival course, and it's all waiting for our two contestants. The sizzling swamp, the secret animal, and we've got it all this week for Wayne Redford and Jackie Deacons. Yay! I know what you're doing. You're a drum majorette, aren't you, Jackie? And what else do you do? What click else? Click rubbers. You click rubbers? How extraordinary. What sort of rubbers? All different type. Really? And how many have you got? 60. Six? six. Over 60 rubbers? My goodness. And your cousin collects them as well, doesn't she? Yeah. And how many has she got? 130. 130 rubbers? I don't believe this. And also they taste or smell, don't they? I yeah. What's the tastiest or smelliest? A strawberry one. A strawberry rubber? How marvellous. Have you got a strawberry rubber, Wayne? No. No, quite right. We men don't have strawberry rubbers, do we? <laughs> but you make models, don't you? Yes. And what do you make? Ships and what's, aeroplanes. What's, your, what's the biggest model you've got? HMS, a model of HMS Hermes. HMS Hermes? And is it all... How, how big is it? That big. What? Oh, enormous. Well done. Very good. Now, I know you'd like to have two helpers, wouldn't you, to help you on this horrible safari course. Would you like two helpers? Yeah. Then you shall have two helpers. <laughs> And here they are, it's Anne Emery and Duncan Goodhue. Happy I've got some happy key. Give them the dog down beat. And they dance here, all night. Oh, I knew it was oh. gonna... That's enough, that's enough, oh. Anne. That's enough. Very good. It's a round of applause there. Yeah. Very good. I knew it was a mistake having Ethel Miko. Well, oh. <laughs> Ethel Miko from Rendigos, oh. alias Anne Ghost Emery. Ghost, you well, guessed. <laughs> <laughs> no ghost today. Where's the rest? Where are the rest? Oh, here? well, Dobbin's in the doghouse. Dobbin's. Oh. oh, and I know Harold, my husband Harold Meeker, he couldn't possibly stay the course on safari. Well, so he's running round the park, skipping, getting into condition for the next series. Oh, well, and, the con and condition, of course. You're, you're in great condition, Duncan, aren't oh, you? Oh, not bad. My London parking's good. Your, your London parking <laughs> was perfect. And listen, when you do a training course, do you swim, I mean, like three or four hours a day or longer? Uh, uh, the, the worst I've ever done, or the best, is six hours. Six one day. hours training. Yeah. And I think it's going to be too much competition for you, don't you? Yes. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so look, yeah, I think we've got a few going obstacles. Like that, you know? hmm? Let's put this there. Uh, stop it, you two. Yes. Let's put these round your fault. waist, I think. Step into waist. that, yeah. Step into that. Go on. <laughs> there don't we waste are. any That's time. Good. Don't waste any time. Don't, <laughs> <laughs> I'll get it done. No, don't right. waste right. any time. And that one, too. And whilst you're doing that, I'd like to meet the people you're going to be playing with today, and that's Wayne and Jackie. Hello. Marvellous. Now, listen. And uh, why don't you tap us to yes. our first game? Why do you do that? I know a lovely tune. Right. On the good ship, a lollipop is a nice ship. To bed we hop Come and on, dream kids. away. Oh. Well, it's coconut time and we paired Anne with Wayne and Duncan with Jackie. Now... In my training pose, we've hidden 12 coconuts. Some are hard to find, some could be easy. What you have to do is find them and bring them back one at a time. Remember, one at a time. Now, you've got one and a half minutes to do that. Are you ready, gang? Yes! I think they are. Right, on your marks, get set, you're off! Come on! Come on. Hey!
Marvel as well. <laughs> each coconut is a number, and each number represents a question. So I'm coming down to see who gets the most questions right. But before I do, let's give a good round of applause there to Jackie and Wayne. <laughs> Now, as you can see, I'm... Anne, please. Anne. Sorry. For goodness sake. It's who asked to hear? Dear, oh dear. Right. Now, where was I? Oh, yes. Now, as you can see, I'm surrounded by some useful and some not-so-useful objects which will help you get across our nasty, gooey, yucky that spot. Right, Wayne, your first question. What number would you like? Number seven. Number seven. <laughs> right. To attract an anchovy, would you shine a light or whistle near the water? Would you shine a light or would you whistle near the water? Whistle. No, you no. wouldn't have that. There we are. Never mind. Oh, you got one just like mine. <laughs> Isn't that lovely? So, Jackie, what do you? What there number would you like? One. Number one. Is it true that peanuts grow underground like potatoes? Yes or no? No. You're wrong. I'm afraid they do. There I we are. It's a nice ball. Oh, we tell you fascinating things yes. on the show. Now, Very Anne. Yes. Your turn. What number would you like? Oh, uh, we've had seven, haven't we? Yes. What about lucky ten? Number ten, yes. right. Is the Victoria Falls in Australia or Africa? It's in Africa. You're right, Anne. I'd like to have oh, this huge easy. rubber ring. That would be very lovely. useful. Ah! <laughs> right, hey, that's Duncan, what do you like? like a man. <laughs> what would you like, Duncan? What well, number? I think eleven, please. Eleven, yeah. right. Do <laughs> other fish eat seahorses? Yes. You're wrong, they don't. Oh, oh no, they don't. Have oh. this little, little duck. Can I have this? No, you oh. can't have that. Put that down. No, oh. have that little duck. Oh, right. that's cute. <laughs> so, Wayne. I've always wanted a duck. What would you like to ask Number now? Number four. Number four. Which would a walrus prefer, clam casserole or cotton chips? Clam casserole or fish and chips? Clam. You're right. Oh, I'm going to give you something yeah. very useful, oh, yeah. which is this plate. There we are. Oh, Pass it over to oh, Wayne. Wayne oh, wants that. Terrific. Oh, right, now, Jackie, what number? Nicole. Number eight. Oh, Can oysters live out of water? Yes. Number You're right, because they keep water in their shells. There we are. There's a nice oh, dustbin for you. Marvellous. Now, so exciting. Anne, what would you like to ask? He said I can look after that. Isn't right. that kind? Isn't it? Can you see you now? Anne, what would oh, you yes. like to ask? Um, I'm surrounded. What, what, what haven't we had? Number four. No, you've had number four. Number six. <laughs> number six. Number six, right. When it wants to turn, warn intruders, the spotted skunk does a handstand. <laughs> true or false? False! You're wrong, it's true! Oh, I don't believe a skunk! Take that leg, that'll <laughs> help you, Anne, right. So, Duncan, what would oh, you like? Your last number question. Number two. Number two, right. Number two, an American iguana is called Chuckawalla. True or false? Chuckawalla, true or false? Knowing the Americans, true. It's true, you're absolutely right. And I'm going to give you this crate. This crate, that's very useful. Now, oh, you've got great. very good things down there. You've oh, got very good wonderful. things. You're oh, both... I take one of these? All right, oh, take both of them. Go on, no, take both of them. Want... And in fact, you take those, and I'll... Anne, I'd like you to carry those across. There oh, we are. Lovely. Oh, I've always goodness. wanted to play ping pong balls. <laughs> the score is always. Anne and Wayne have two, and Duncan and Jackie have two. It's perfect. Yay! Let's. <laughs> I'm so confused, but do let's take all these things, including Anne's ping pong balls, yes. over the swamp. <laughs> uh, this really is truly revolting, but I don't care. Now, what they have to do is get across the swamp using the equipment. They can only use each item once, and if they don't use it, they must carry it. So, on your marks. That's Get set! You're off! Right. Good luck! Now, what shall I do? Okay. Be there, lie down. Yeah. Go on now. Come on, don't talk about it, do it. What are you going to do? No! Uh, He's over! He's yeah. a boss! Very good.
Ross needs to I throwing won. it. I, think I we're, won. <laughs> we'll save this then. They deserve two points each, and that's all, because they all cheated. Let's find out what the score is. <laughs> Duncan and Jackie, four. And Anne and Wayne, four. <laughs> Well, here we are at Mystery Animal Time. I must say, that was the muckies. You're quite right to clean your little duck up, honestly. Poor that... little Gertrude got such a ducking. Oh, oh. <laughs> dear. Right. Now, we're going to show you the Mystery Animal at home. But if you want to play the game, close your eyes now. Tight. No peeking. We're on with the game now. Now, here's your first visual clue. This is a lovely, soft, fleecy sweater. A nice, woolly jumper. Right, that's your visual clue. Now, here's your riddle. I'm a beast of burden, and I can walk 12 miles a day. Some of us are mountain wild, but me, I'm soft and tame. Ah. Oh, uh, I'll repeat it again. <laughs> I'm a beast of burden, I can walk 12 miles a day. Some of us are mountain wild, but me, <laughs> I'm soft and tame. Yeah. Right, now, you can each ask me a question. Duncan's writing well, something down already. Yeah. Now, Anne, what would you like to ask? When it's cooked, do you have mint sauce with it? <laughs> you certainly don't. Oh, right, I crossed that out. Don't then. worry, he's getting very upset in there, honestly. <laughs> right, now, what would you like to ask? No peeking. What would you like to ask, Wayne? Um, <laughs> has it got <laughs> fur? Yes, it has got fur. Oh, well done. Mm. How do you uh, spell fur? Yes, and what would you like to ask, Jackie? Does it live on the... Uh, has it got four legs? It's got four legs, absolutely, four legs. and Duncan. Ooh. Does it have a beard? No, it doesn't really have a beard, oh. no. I know what you're getting at, but it doesn't really have a beard. Right, yes, now, with all those facts and all the visual clues and uh. the riddles, you have ten seconds to write down what do you think is this week's mystery animal. Go on, write it. That isn't our mystery animal, but I shall now reveal to you what it is. Open sesame! Oh, oh. isn't that lovely? It's Charlie. Oh, what is lovely. it? It's a llama. Of course. How Come do you spell here. that? <laughs> ah, little oh, thing. That's it, Charlie. Yes, now, what I've have got you put, that. Anne, down there? Rabbit llama. You put rabbit first, didn't you? Rich, you thought you were a rabbit, Charlie, honestly. And what have you put? Goat or sheep. Goat or sheep. Well, no, oh, I can't really give any points for that. What oh, about you, Jackie? Sheep. sheep, no. Put goatee. Goatee, no. Oh, I can't. No points. Oh, but look. There are some bonus questions. First of all, though, I'd like to tell you, of course, this was an, uh, a sweater, so, you know, that was, that was to do with the, the wool and everything. Yes. And then, of course, there were the things like, I'm a beast of burn, and he oh, can yes. walk. Can't yes. you, Charlie? 12 yes. miles a day, Charlie can walk, absolutely. Could be a big rabbit. And you've got to remember that he's soft <laughs> and tame. So he used to be mountain wild, but look how he's soft and tame, soft little and thing. Tame. Does he bite? No, he, of course he doesn't, oh, do you, Charlie? Does he swim oh. in the swamp? No, he doesn't swim in the swamp. <laughs> but listen, I've got a bonus question now, just for the kids, this is, if I can find it. Now, here we are. What's the name of the animal which is very similar to Charlie here, from which we get thick, woolly jumpers? What is it, kids? Sheep. No. Goats. No. Any help from the grown-ups there? From for which a... we get thick, woolly jumpers? Yes. What are these sort of jumpers called? Mohair. They... No, not mohair. Where are you going, Charlie? Camel. No, Camel. sorry, no points there, because alpaca. 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 So there we are. Right, now I'm going to tell you, Charlie, come face around here. That's it. Lovely, oh, Charlie. Come Charlie. on. Now, look. Now, Charlie, llamas, in fact, are beasts of burden, but they're no fools. Yeah, if they right, load right. is too heavy, they lie down and refuse to move. And when angered, they kick and spit in temper. Oh, no. But, of course, Charlie won't do that, will you, Charlie? Certainly he no. won't. No. Right, let's <laughs> find out what the score that. is after that round. As there was nothing scored that time, Anne and Wayne have four, and Duncan and Jackie have four. <laughs> well, I must say I'm terrified at our pool crossing, because you saw what our contestants did today Ooh. at the swamp. The mess was unbelievable. Well, here we are at the clear water crossing. Now, all they have to do is get across our pool with the use of these hammocks. Now, Anne, any problem for you? I don't think so, as long as you're going to tell me how to do it. Please. I'll tell you all the way through. And, Duncan... What about you? Well, there's, there's a room around the camp that you're going to swim against me. I'll swim against you any time you like. Length start? A length start, that's absolutely. And you be careful of your duck there. On your marks, good luck, you're off! Oh, oh, man. Man.
Trophy and so oh, do you, Jackie. That. And Jackie, beautiful. you've won a lovely lovely, diggy lovely this week. Right. Isn't that marvellous? Okay. Right, Ooh. we're all going to have a nice cup of tea. There we are, Jackie. There's your tea. Duncan, there's oh, your tea. Please. Anne, yes. you're not going to have any tea. For oh. goodness sake, get on with the breakfast, oh, you and yes. Wayne. Dear, oh dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Soon if we get staff nowadays. Do you want one Say goodbye. Lump or two? Bye. One lump or two. Bye bye. <laughs> <laughs>